Hey guys, what's going on? It's Avatar here, and welcome to a brand new How to Get an Easy Camp Strike. This one we're doing is on the map Flooded. Uh, right after this, you're going to be seeing a Camp Strike gameplay with the MTAR Suppressor and Foregrip. So feel free to stay tuned for that right after this short uh, little uh, tutorial on how to get an Easy Camp Strike. Um, hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I've been getting a lot of positive feedback towards this series, and a lot of people saying how it's been helping them get a lot of Camp Strikes on these maps. And uh, yeah, so thank you a lot to everybody who sent me um, a message or left a comment that's just saying how this is helping them out. I really do appreciate it, guys. And there's going to be lots more videos these to come. And the great thing about this series is it's literally every single map in the game. And it goes for this game mode as well as Blitz. And eventually I'll be doing probably some different game modes too. So it's going to be a lot of good stuff to see. So we're going to be on the map Flooded Free For All here. And I definitely suggest you use a sub. This, guy, this class right here, really. You know, MTAR with muzzle brake and uh, foregrip, that work perfectly. You know, anything really you want. I personally suggest the MTAR, even the Bison could work, Vepper as well, uh, K7, any any SMG. I would not suggest an AR. Um, if you're going to use an AR, I would use the Honey Badger. But anyway, so this is going to be the spot you're going to be holding down. Uh, going to be right here. It's pretty simple. It, it, you get a lot of spawn kills. So this is going to be a lot similar to Warhawk, um, if, you, if you saw my video on that. Uh, main spawn point going to be right here. This is where you're going to be looking. There's another spawn point, I believe, right here. And you'll be seeing people um, like spawning over there and stuff, but you don't really worry about that too much. It's just that spawn, and this is the number one spawn right here. And one thing you have to be careful of is sometimes if you're running in this room or in that room over there, you have to be careful because there is a spawn point right here. So if you do leave the room briefly, if you, you might want to come in ADSing this spot because there could have potentially been somebody that just spawned in. Um, that's pretty it, you know, that's really the only spawns you're going to be looking for. You're just going to be looking back and forth here and pushing, you know, lay prone. You'll hear them anywhere. It's really easy map. This is another one of those maps where I could not figure out a good strategy for, but eventually after grinding free for all for uh, uh, enough time, I definitely figured out a really, really effective strategy. I've gotten lots and lots of chems on this map. But one thing you do want to be careful for, if, if you like to jump out on people like I do, I hear somebody coming, I like to jump out on them. Be very, very careful of these things right here, because lots of times you'll try to jump out on them, but you'll climb up instead. I've died at multiple 20 plus kill streaks on this map due to the fact that I go to jump out on somebody like that, and I climb as they're coming out, and I die. So be aware of that, but now you're going to be seeing some chem strike gameplay on this map using the MTAR suppressor. Hope you guys do enjoy, and like the video for some more chem strike, easy chem strike guides. Ready for direction. Mark the DZ. Dead eye. <laughs> Enemy SATCOM spotted. Care package ready for delivery. Enemy SATCOM spotted. Quick draw.
Specialist bonus achieved. Enemy SATCOM spotted. Strike incoming. <laughs> 